Hi guys, it's Katie from Insert Disc here, and this is episode 3 of Titan Souls, which, in which we face the third boss. Uh, he is a giant block of ice with a brain inside. He slides around, he charges you, and he also has a jump attack, which only really comes out when you stay alive for long enough, which I found to be quite a challenge. So I've shown you, um, I wanted to show you me playing everything, but as you can see, uh, two minutes in you get your first death. And so I just showed you how often I died. And I only showed you about four of my deaths. Because I'm sure you would want to watch the same thing over and over again with me rolling around, failing to get the idea of what to do, and getting smushed by a giant brain. So now this one, I, uh, that I'm going to show you now, I actually did manage. I think this was after a good hour stuck on this boss. I think I do die once or twice before I get it right. But what I did figure out is that your arrow needs to be shot strategically. And I've said this before, but of course I don't get my own advice. However, this boss blocks it. So if you shoot your arrow and he gets in the way, it blocks it, which leads to getting swished, like that. So trying to light the arrow on the flame and get it back to you and into him before it goes out without getting squished was quite a challenge. Now, I figured out that you need to lure him onto one of the fire pads, which are located in, in, this, in the cross, and then just about timing and positioning. See, there I got it right, but by the time it was back to me, it was it was already extinguished. See, I was trying to lure him, trying to lure him in a in a straight line so that I could at least get to the flame before it went out, before he moved out of the way. See, I was close to the flame there. That was good. That was what I wanted. And then, there's a perfect, perfect opportunity, which is well done because it went through the rain through the flame and th straight to his eyes. Now we get to this part of the fight where there is a giant splishy brain that looks like he's got a face splishing after you, putting out brain juice that gets you stuck. So if you're in the brain juice, you are slowed. He jumps a far distance and he jumps fast. So all I was doing was just rolling around in circles, trying to get my bearings or I used my arrow and uh, I think I actually made my arrow chase me around here for quite a while because I just didn't have the time to get it before that. And this was an actual moment of joy. It was relief. And I'm pretty proud of myself for doing that. And the beams of light that do nothing to me. And that is the third boss of Titan Souls done. So now let's go and have a look at what else awaits us in episode 4. At least I didn't try to roll up the steps that time. And it is a giant stone 
monster that is coming after me and trying to squish me with his fists. So that is something for you guys to look forward to in episode 4 of Titan Souls Let's Play. Thank you so much for watching guys. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I hope to see you back soon. Thanks guys. Bye bye. Thank you.